This is Scott from KIG. It is Saturday, July 6th. Uh, this is our 45 ton carrier chiller, 460 volt. This one is serial number 021 F56038. This is the 30GT series, again, a 45 ton chiller. Uh, we have it hooked up to power. I'm just going to come over here and I'm going to put it on uh, enable. It might be a little bit of a delay before we start uh, start chilling. Uh, but one of the things we can uh, can see now is the as entering water temperature of 72.2 degrees. And we're just going to show it chilling down to about, about 50 degrees. Now this unit was originally set up um, as the buyer knows uh, in a remote evaporator configuration so that shell tube evaporator slash exchanger that was actually in in the building we took it and we reinstalled it back the way it was intended uh, we provided all new uh, we put in new piping new dryers new sight glasses those are the two new dryers those are the two new sight glasses uh, and this piping um, this will be insulated by the way right before it ships out um, so we put this chiller barrel back in the way it was supposed to be and reconnected all the uh, all the wiring back up to the uh, the TXV valves are supposed to be tied in correctly with the uh, with the circuit board uh, again when I press enable there will be a, a delay before it turns on and starts it. there we go so uh, again we got the compressor just kicked in. Um, this is our tank test assembly, about 500 liters of water, a little over 70, you know, about the same as you see in the controller of the chiller. But that's just redundant there, you can see it's about 72 degrees or so. Um, these are our pumps on our test station and our heater to heat the glycol water mix. Um, we have three pumps here, we actually have two of them running for this test, and you can see just our connections back there to the chiller barrel. You can already see it starting to chill a little bit, um, that's the entering water temperature, but let's go to the leaving water temperature, which will obviously be a little bit colder. So. Uh, 68.7, put on another tenth of a degree in a second, there you go. So we're going to come back with the second video as we approach the set point, which is at about, at about 50.